fibrous capsules are okay cortex and medulla the snow cap mountains medullary pyramids that's the mountains and papilla the very tip of the mountain yeah right there and renal column between the mountains and major calyx that's where this two little funnels come together so there's one there there's one there and there's a cut open one and that's there. one you won't label yeah, that's one so i only label it there or there and then these are all minor calyces okay that act like funnels to collect the urine as it oozes out from the pillow. and the renal pelvis no, that's it's number four number four is where all the urine from everything is collected and then it's good, it goes out through number the three ureter. which is the ureter and then the renal artery is number two and the renal vein is way down there, number one. So we're going to start there and end there. So it goes from renal artery to segmental arteries. So there's one there and one there. Uh, then up into the anterior lobar arteries, which are going up through the renal columns. Uh, from there, it goes into these arching and thus called arcuate arteries. And there's one here. Okay. And then from there, into the little rays of sunshine, which are the um, cortical radiant arteries. Right, so there's a whole bunch of them there, and there's two of them here. Okay, and then the Aferent, afferent arterial. So these two are toward um, yes. the inside of these spheres, so they're going to be medial here, or the large one here, because remember you have more fluid coming in than going out. And then the glum... Um, the glomerulus is yeah. the capillary, so there's one Little there, spheres. one there, and one there, so there's only three places you see that. And then the efferent arterioles come out from the other side. All right, so efferent comes in on the same side of the cortical radiant arteries. The efferents, there's one there, there's one there, one there. And the paratubular capillaries, where the red and the blue, blue states meet. come together. So number eleven, wherever that is. And then, okay. and then you play it backwards. So you have cortical radiant veins, like you have cortical oh, radiant yeah. arteries. You have arcuate veins, like you have arcuate arteries. You have interlobar veins, like you have interlobar arteries. So, so they're. In this model, um, cortical radiant veins, there's three of them, acute vein uh, right there arching, uh, interlobar vein right there right next to the interlobar artery. Uh, and then we skip segmental in terms of veins and we end up with the renal vein. Awesome. Thanks.